Cyclone Idai kills at least 31 as it hits eastern Zimbabwe. In addition to the 24 people killed by Cyclone Idai, the Zimbabwean government said so far over 100 people were missing in the Chimanamani district, and some may have died. At least 31 people have been killed, and dozens are missing as tropical cyclone Idai hit eastern parts of Zimbabwe after lashing neighboring Mozambique, the government said on Saturday. Most of the deaths were in Chimanamani town, Zimbabwe's information ministry announced on Twitter. Two of the victims were students who died after a landslide sent a boulder crashing into their dormitory collapsing the wall of the dining room and trapping 50 of them, the country's Department of Civil Protection DCP said in a statement. The boarding school has been shut in the army, which is leading rescue operations, is moving in to take the nearly 200 students to safety. So far a total of 71 people are reported missing, said the DCP. Others who had fled their homes were stranded on top of a mountain waiting to be rescued, including workers from a diamond mine, as strong winds and poor visibility hampered helicopter flights, the government said. The storm damaged many houses and washed away bridges in the eastern Manicaland province which borders Mozambique. Thousands of people have been affected by power cuts and flooding, a lawmaker told AFP. Earlier Saturday, Joshua Sacco, an MP in Chimanamani district, told AFP that more than 100 people were missing. Around 100 houses had been swept away in the Gangu township in Chimanamani town, he said. Strong winds ripped roofs off prison cells in the southern city of Misbingo, according to state broadcasters EBC. The opposition movement for democratic change called for immediate help for the storm hit east warning that a serious humanitarian crisis was unfolding. We need state intervention on a massive scale to avoid biblical disaster, MDC spokesman Jacob Matthew wrote on Twitter. President Emerson Mangagwa, who is currently on a visit to Abu Dhabi, has declared a state of disaster in the affected areas. My thoughts and prayers are with all those affected by Cyclone Idai. Rescue operations are underway and we are grateful for the bravery of the men and women of the Zimbabwean Armed Forces who, along with our local and international partners, are participating in the urgent rescue efforts. He tweeted. Tropical cyclone Idai battered central Mozambique on Friday killing at least 21 people there and cutting off more than half a million residents of the port city Vera. Even before the cyclone made landfall on Friday, heavy rains earlier in the week had already claimed 66 lives and forced 17,000 people from their homes in Mozambique, local officials said. They also affected neighboring Malawi, where 56 people died. As the cyclone hit, Mozambique's president Philip Nyusi appealed for emergency assistance for the victims before leaving for Eswatini. We have compatriots suffering without hope, and we have to restore hope," he said on Friday as he set off on a three-day state visit to the kingdom previously known as Swaziland. But in a statement Saturday his office said he was cutting short the Eswatini trip and would travel to the affected central regions on Sunday. As the cyclone approached, the Red Cross sent out more than 200 volunteers to areas most likely to be affected. The situation is dire, but we don't know the exact particulars," said Jamie Lesueur, the Red Cross's roving emergency operations manager for Africa. The crisis requires a swift response with the full force of the humanitarian community behind the government of Mozambique, he told AFP. Barrows International Airport was closed after the cyclone damaged the air traffic control tower, the navigation systems and the runways. The storm also affected power supplies to neighboring South Africa which imports electricity from Mozambique to supplement its own production. South Africa's power utility company Eskom on Saturday introduced electricity rationing. At least 24 dead as Cyclone I died battered Zimbabwe. At least 24 people have died in southeastern Zimbabwe as homes and bridges were swept away by a tropical storm. The country's information ministry said on Saturday. Cyclone Idai, which brought flood water and destruction to areas of Mozambique and Malawi, hit Zimbabwe on Friday, cutting off power and communications. 
Number of deaths is confirmed at 24 mainly from Chimanamani East. The number of missing people is currently 40, and the fatalities include two students, the ministry said on Twitter. Joshua Sacco, a member of parliament in the eastern district of Chimanamani, told Reuters that the storm had left a trail of destruction reminiscent of Cyclone Ellen in February 2000, which devastated southern Zimbabwe. Sacco said the death toll was expected to rise as authorities continued to assess the situation. Chimanamani, which borders Mozambique, has been worst affected, with the storm causing floods as well as destroying crops, Zimbabwe's Ministry of Information said. Air Force helicopters were rescuing people, but flights were being slowed by heavy winds. Zimbabwe has faced a severe drought this year that has damaged crops and a United Nations humanitarian agency says 5.3 million people will require food aid this year. The country's meteorological services expect rains to continue throughout the weekend, 